That little gopher was so sweet and he just kept coming right out. And there's been a couple like that. They don't come as close, but it's almost like they get a vibe from her that she's just gentle and sweet. They all seem really relaxed every day. She just is really excited. The moment she realizes we're going to the park, she could tell when we hit this one street, oh, we're going to the big park. The moment she gets out of the car, she's just on a mission. She goes in this one area and runs tree to tree, searching for squirrels. She's like, I just want to be friends with you. Some of them are getting a little braver. I think that one wants to be friends with her, but he's not really sure. Usually the gophers are on the way back. She would just be smelling all the smells at the park. And then she would just really hone in on these little mounds of dirt. They're starting to get to know her in this little grove. So she is kind of making friends with a few. She can tell when one mound is old and there's no gopher there. And these ones were obviously fresh and she can tell right away, oh, there's a gopher here. So she would just plop down and she would just wait. So it could be half an hour just sitting. It surprised me that she had the patience to sit there for so long. Let's go. Stand up. Up. At my house, she gets very stubborn. You could leave for 10 minutes, come right back, and she just plops right in front of the front door. She's like, you were gone, and I'm not ready to get up yet. I'm comfortable here. You're not coming in. Really? She's done that many times, and we have to, like, weasel our way in. Or... She is just a really relaxed lady. When she's going for a walk, sometimes she'll sit in front of a restaurant. Sometimes she'll sit on every street corner. It's like she's waiting for someone to say hi. Sometimes I'm like, okay, we're on a strict schedule here, so focus, woman. <laughs> she's no help. She gets to pick the destination. If you say, let's go this way, she's just like, no, I want to go this way today. So you kind of just have to leave your day open a little bit when you're on the walk and go with the flow. I've learned the entire Golden Gate Park, all the cool little areas it has to offer. Just seeing the world through her eyes is just really exciting.